Stetson, you're down here in Florida for the first time, your first camp to participate in uh, as a Pittsburgh Pirate. First off, what's this experience been like for you to be able to come down here and get ready for your first professional season? You know, it's been pretty exciting, you know, seeing everybody, seeing what they're doing and, uh, you know, talking with them and, you know, they're pretty, they're real friendly to me, which is awesome and, you know, it's, it's real comforting and uh, I'm excited to be here. How, what's it like just beyond, be beyond the high school now, you're, you know, you were going through your high school senior season last year, you're getting ready for the draft, and just be able to go out and just pitch. Uh, it's pretty special, to be honest with you. I was never really a big school guy in the first place, but, um, you know, just to come out, keep my head clear, and, you know, just pitch and do my thing, which I've been waiting for my whole life, is pretty amazing. When you look back, uh, you know, now that you're able to look back after a few months, how special was that day when you were drafted and then uh, a couple soon thereafter you signed with the Pirates. How special is that uh, now that you can look back at that moment? Uh, you know, I talk to my dad about it all the time. You know, that was one of the, you know, the highlights of my life. And, you know, we both uh, were very excited that day, you know. Uh, happy the Pirates picked me, you know, given, you know, that it's a great opportunity to be here, and I'm excited to be here. You seem like you're always around Pirate City with, with Jameson Tyon. It seems like wherever he is, you are. What kind of special bond have the two of you formed since the both of you, since um, both of you were drafted? You know, we, we became really good friends. You know, we're here for, you know, we want the, the challenge and we want to get to the bigs as fast as we can. You know, if we're not there at the same time, you know, it just pushes one of us to get there even faster. So, you know, we're real good buddies and, you know, I, I, I feel like we'll continue to be good buddies. You had an opportunity just to, to, to be around the, the, the environment last year with State College, just to be able to do that and, and go through the bus trips and, and, you know, the hotels you're going to be staying in. Is that kind of experience helpful whenever you're going to go to your first professional season just to kind of get an idea of what what's going to be in store for you? Yeah, you know, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. You know, I was expecting a little bit worse, but for the most part, I had a, you know, it was a fun time. The bus rides were long, but, you know, you're playing baseball and not having to go to school. You can't really beat that. Um, and finally, uh, when you look at the, you know, you guys, you and Jameson were obviously the two guys that grabbed the headlines first and second round picks respectively last year. But talk about some of the talent that you also saw as a teammate at State College. Some of the guys, the, the Alberto Santos of the world, and, and Mel Rojas Jr., and Trent Stevenson, and Colton Kane, and Zach Von Rosenberg. How excited are you to, to step up as you climb this ladder to the big leagues with these guys? Uh, you know, it's pretty special. We're all, you know, we're, we're all good friends, and to see all of us succeed would be pretty special. Um, you know, they're all great pitchers, too. Um, it's pretty awesome that maybe one day that we could all be pitching in the bigs together, which would be pretty awesome because we're all really good buddies.